Hi everyone, today I will be sharing to you how I made this mushroom bread. So let's begin by adding the 1 cup warm milk into our mixing bowl. Then we will add 1 egg and half cup of sugar. Then we will just mix it and add 2 tablespoons of oil. You can also use shortening if it's available. But if not, you can also use cooking oil or even olive oil. Depends on you. Then we will add 3 cups of all-purpose flour and 1 fourth cup of cornstarch. Then 2 teaspoons of baking powder, 1 teaspoon of baking soda, 2 teaspoons of yeast. You can use instant dry yeast. Also, you will add vanilla sugar or vanilla powder and then one teaspoon of salt then just put it in the stand mixer and then we will knead it for one to two speed in a low setting then we will add two tablespoons of unsalted butter until everything is well incorporated then we just continue to knead in the same speed there's no amount of time until you reach the smooth consistency or the dough becomes soft but probably you will take uh, four to five minutes to reach the desired texture of the dough so it will be easier for you to maneuver onto the desired shape or to mold it into ball shape then we can transfer it into our dough mat and cut it into equal parts you can use weighing scale to make sure the sizes are equal but for me i'm just using the dough cutter and then estimate the sizes of each part this kind of dough doesn't need to be rested or proof it for one hour so you can mold it after you can directly just uh, shape into round as much as you can you can do it by rolling your palm onto the dough mat and then just uh, roll it for a couple of times until it becomes so smooth just like a ball i did try to use both of my hands but it didn't work well it's the first time that i make this but uh, it's a little bit hard to do it on both hands at the same time so i made a bunch and it's like two inches in diameter for each sizes so i did try my best to make it perfectly round i think uh, i did it so while we rest the dough for like 30 minutes we will also make the egg wash it's a combination of one egg yolk and about two tablespoons of milk and then we just mix it well and we can just brush it on top of each piece resting this dough will not make it rise even if we rest it for 15 or 30 minutes but it will make the bread become soft after we bake it normally you can bake it on 160 to 180 degrees temperature for like 15 to 20 minutes for the last five minutes you will just reduce the heat of your oven or until you see the crack side of the bread so you will know when it's already done and also we can taste it now so this kind of bread is not uh, as soft as other bread it's like in between of soft and hard or as we say it's like a dense texture bread so i thought it's gonna be difficult for me to make it but i just found it so easy to make and uh, i was happy with the result and also you can enjoy this with a cup of coffee while it's hot it's really good you can try this and let me know in the comment what you think of this recipe see you again next time bye